Welcome back to part 5 of Sonic Forces, where we've all slowly realized, oh man, we're let's play Sonic Forces and oh god. <laughs> this game is, this game is, Operation like, Big this, Wave! This game is, is probably one, one of the shortest um, main series 3D games, but talking over it feels fucking long, dude. This is the third time I've had to do this, and I'm, I'm, I'm seriously questioning Wait, third time what you mistakes had to do... I've made out of life. Wait, third time you had to do what? Uh, talk over this game. Wait, what? I you... did fist bump. I, I was I was in the brain scratch LP, and now we're doing this. It's oh my god! Oh. I, I really ha I really have to stop being in brain scratch videos. It just ruins my life. Yeah, fuck it. Right. So what you're saying is that you're going to be doing it a fourth time on uh, Chris's channel. <laughs> Uh, I've decided to let's play Sonic Forces with this exact same. <laughs> Gareth, didn't didn't you try to hundred percent this game? Chemical plan. Uh, Who would yeah, ever do that? Um, Have you yeah. yet? Oh, I found a curve. No, I got no, I got I got all S ranks. I got all the red rings, uh, Why? Moon coins, numbered rings. Because I thought, you know what? Because I was in a bad place in my, I was in a bad place in my life. Steve. Fuck this ramp. And this game made it worse. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I, I put a, a video on on uh, Twitter. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Where even even if you're supersonic, you can't run up that ramp. Like the physics in this game was <sighs> so fucking bad. It's insane. I'm not even. I'm not even sure that's physics. I'm wondering if that's scripted to not let you up there easy or something weird. It can't, uh, why would why would why, would they why is it they accessible? To script that. That just it's so. Bad. I don't know, but Wait, you're not good at games. Do so much unnecessary scripting in the first place. I wouldn't put it past them. Why didn't you get in that red ring? Why didn't you go back? Go get that red. Why didn't you get? Because because Chris is taking a page out of Mia's Sonic Colors. Fuck it, it's right there. I'm gonna do it. The the act need it. the actual Fuck script it. the actual script is, of this game already has problems. You think that the scripting. Would be any better? I don't speak Spanish. Could you repeat that in uh, Japanese? <laughs> um, Konnichiwa. Spanish, what the fuck? Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, the scripting isn't that great in this game. Oh. Uh, Stefan, Stefan, just say Itatake Mash for no reason, just to annoy Steven. Yeah, so you can be like Connie and Steven. <laughs> Itatake Mash! God damn it. I swear to God. I, Connie! Connie is the worst character in Steven Universe. I, I hate love her. the fact that Steven, I love that that annoys you so much. It's amazing. Well, it's just fucking stupid. What's wrong with her? For no reason. They're just about to have a meal, and then she shouts, "It's a donkey mass!" And I'm like, "You know Fuck why? You. It's, because, it's because everyone who walks on that show are into anime and shit. And That's show, fine. They're, they're That's fine. Out. That's fine. Whoa. No, it's not. Anime must be destroyed. Anime must no. be destroyed. What? <laughs> Do you guys remember the water segment from Chemical? Whoa, Pizza? water's moving. Do you guys That's remember? never happened before. Do you, oh, do you remember? Like I popcorn. know what this is. Sonic, whatever it you is do. It's so trivial here. I love it. So There's another red ring, Chris. Get it. Get the red yeah, ring. But, but <laughs> this isn't my main profile. Well, I don't well, need the trophy well, right here. Te well, technically, <laughs> if this is somebody's first Sonic game, they would have never played Chemical Plant before. I know I what this so is! If this is someone's first Sonic These game... These are like... things I know! <laughs> Very cool. Green Hills Chemical Plants! Green Hills Chemical Plants! Death Eggs! <laughs> <laughs> Classic Sonic! You're gonna die. Metal, metal, gonna... Chris, Chris metal, metal Sonic boss fight, but no Stardust Speedway, it broke new ground! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's the end of the uh, level. See, uh, that one took almost three minutes. <laughs> uh, three, yeah. That's the best level in the game. See, the, the levels feel half as short as they should be. Yeah, they feel really... And again, a lot of them just feel like... It's that the one. Fact that, that I'm at a joke! And... Okay, there we go. <laughs> God damn. That stage actually has a whole upper section I've only seen once. It's kind of hard to get to, but they has an actual alternate path. Is that what you were trying to get to in the beginning? You know what? It's like it's like a, a, a lot of a lot of defenders of this game will bring up the fact that this game the levels are full of alternate paths. I defenders. And, and oh, are, and I know. <laughs> technically. Or, or a lot of the levels do feature little alternate paths that take you like they don't really do much and all like occasionally they'll, they'll just be like a red ring section so on the one hand yes but they're so 
ultimately unfulfilling. It's like, what's the point? And like, I will you say know? Unleashed had stuff like that, but Unleashed had this weird way of doing that, but giving you the oh, illusion oh, there was I'm more going on. Unleashed was fun, though. Unleashed had had, had pretty decent level at, and that. For, for, for the daytime stages. Unleashed had pretty decent, and I will say it, Unleashed isn't boost to win, but I do think the day stages are, are amazingly linear compared to some other Sonic games, but they're, they're still fun. I'll give them that. Unleashed daytime stages are still fun. This, this game is... So this level, as we're about to come up to, this is the one where we are going to see Sonic KO, a, a, a Death of Grover in one hit. And also, for some reason, the first 26 seconds or so has a music track, which on, on the soundtrack goes for like three minutes. <laughs> yeah. So also, this, this for some reason, because there is a little section at the beginning, this is the only boss fight level which is treated as a rule level. So there are red rings... Um, red rings, moon coins, and numbered coins to get in this boss fight. So when you fight Metal Sonic, if you want to do everything, you have to fight this boss like three times. Which, are, yeah. And it was, because it's pretty easy and the boss track's pretty good, it, it's one of the less painful ones to replay a lot. And then you play the infinite fight later, and you're like, oh, oh, oh. Perfect. Oh, no. oh you broke it, Sonic. Again! If, it, if it's that fucking easy, why can't we just go destroy all of them in four seconds? Uh, because uh, when Sonic was missing, all the characters forgot how to curl into a ball. And then when they saw Sonic do it, they went, Oh, oh heck, we can also curl into a ball. Guys, we've had our, the wrong uh, thing. And that's why now they can fight the Metal Sonic from what, Sonic Extreme. What, what's, the po He's a big what's, the po what's the point of having an infinite Metal Sonic? Just use Metal, just use your own Metal Sonic. He's bigger, well, look at him. Which, production look at which makes, but also this, this boss fight is just the infinite snake battle, and also this is kind of just Metal Sonic's boss fight from Rise of Lyric as well. Like, a lot of the bosses are pretty underwhelming in this game. Well, Weirdly, I'm confused. Zabon gets Wait. like an original boss. Yeah, for some, for some reason, for some reason, they give the worst boss in, in Sonic history, or sorry, the worst character in Sonic history, like the most unique boss fight in this game. It's weird. Well, you say that implying anyone played Rise of Lyrics, so really, it's new to everyone. We did. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing. I will say though, I am, I am kind of, um, I am kind of happy we didn't, we got the American version of Star Speedway Bad Future. Um, I, I like the Japanese track, but it's been overplayed so much over the last like, since the generations. That I'm glad we got something new for once. Yeah. Well, they. So, you know, so that's one thing new. This dubstep, fucking crazy. This, this crazy dubstep. It just sounds like this. This sounds like there's a bunch of pneumatic drums going off. It's great. Right. So yeah, Metal Sonic's big. He's huge. Look at how huge he is. For no reason. Why isn't he like a billion times bigger? Just cause. Well, yeah. Why isn't he as big as one of the Death Egg robots? That would be cool. Or you could fight the the Metal Sonic from Chaotix, the well, final would, boss. Then they'd have to acknowledge yeah. Chaotix. You, you could. <laughs> Yeah. Or, yeah, or if, if you're bringing back a whole bunch of of the villains, why don't you bring all the rest of the villains? Like make it make an infinite version of Black Doom, make an infinite version of Razor Jin. It goes, partner. It really bothers me. It's the same lines of dialogue every time. I want an infinite version of a mean? gigantic motobug rolling down the city, destroying everything in its Her. path. It. <laughs> I should walk back that Wait, statement. Chris, I think, yeah, what do you, I think what there do you it's original, but in the Infinite Fight, don't they just use the same dialogue from Arsenal Pyramid? Oh, maybe. I think that's what they did, and it's really like a sore thumb kind of thing. You got an me. A. A. If an alien race Eggman were to see this place. video, and this is the only thing they were able to know about our society. <laughs> and they send this LP out into space. <laughs> Yeah, if this is the only thing that alien races were to know about our society. Humanity is doomed. Humanity is already doomed. Okay, Canadian. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Okay, Dad. Why can't he say space station? <laughs> Wait a minute, I think you... <laughs> I feel like... There was a slight edit there. <laughs> No, it's fine. We just distract Eggman. Oh, okay. <laughs> Your tweet. Yeah, Chris, that face, that face is, is just a shadow face. Yep. He looks annoyed, yep. I am important in the game. It's me, the rookie. Hello, how are you? I'm so happy. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> it's me. I am, stage. I am so happy. Green <laughs> Guardian. What the hell is a Guardian Rock? Um... Oh, you know, it's like the, the Brotherhood of Guardians. 
Have you, have you not been paying attention to the latest updates for the Lara Suit Chronicles? Oh, oh uh, no. My finger is on the pulse. David, get the fuck out of the <laughs> No, it's important. This is, it's another news update from the world of campaign. Apparently, apparently the app's going to come out in April. Guys. That's probably when this LP is coming out, so make sure to download it now. Hey. Oh, man. And use the code FTCR to get 5% off your purchase. Oh, oh. Off ca I'll, I'll, can, can you use time? FTCR to get 10% off a of Casper mattress? Oh, can hey. you try to set up a deal with Ken hey. to get 5% hey. off with... First, yes. <laughs> Secondly, Lisa is the new mattress on podcast. Thank you very much. Oh, do Lisa? L e e s a. Um, use the offer code FTCR. They send it to you for a hundred dollars. <laughs> it's in a box. Look, I prefer the classics. If you want to make a website, use Squarespace. Space. <laughs> Man, <Isn't> it beautiful. <laughs> uh, there's so favorite. many of these level design segments where it's like run right robots, run left yeah. robots. Ugh. <laughs> Robots are. So, it's, it is weird how, like, so we should say, at, at the very start of, of the game in part two, it says, you know, select either um, hard or normal. Uh -huh. And I believe literally the only difference is in normal mode, you, it won't save your time. Oh. I think that's correct. That that, that, that bridge is fucking bullshit. I always you have get no, hit there. You have no idea it's there, and it just it kills you. It's it, that is fucking that is horrible level design, and it's still a line. It's just so fucking dumb. Well, you know, because the the, the like, sand though, sand hurts you immediately. Have you ever touched sand? Look, remember. It's rough and coarse, and it gets exactly. Everywhere. I do not touch sand. Thank you. Oh. Oh Wait, man, that crab can jump. Is this the fourth time we've been to Green Hill? <laughs> yes. Well, yeah, yeah. I think that's the Green right. Ev Rock. Every uh... all three characters go to each level, and then some and... of them have also a boss fight. So. Right, and Shadow went here too, right? That too, yeah. Well, that was here. virtual reality. Oh yeah, that was weird. Oh. Like it was a virtual reality construct of a version of Green Hill Zone that wouldn't exist for a few months, but then it came into existence. But that wasn't a virtual construct, even though it looked exactly the same. That was the prototype. Um, oh, the prototype of the Green Hill Zone, which was shown in 1990 at the Tokyo Toy Show. I remember. Yes. Okay. Infinite's a huge fan. Were, were, were you there the at the Tokyo Game Show in 1990? Yes, I was five years old, uh, and I I hopped a plane, and I flew to Japan, and I was like, wow, cool, that's Sonic the Hedgehog. This is the thing that I'm going to become obsessed with for the next 25 years of my life. David, he, you're cursed. <laughs> he went to the airport, hopped on a plane, and was there in no time. If, if those, if those fucking, Oh, yeah, Team those Sonic! Fucking, if those, um... Kind of like grapple things are so powerful, why doesn't everyone have them? And also, like it, it's that it, it is another like kind of big missed opportunity. You would think having kind of like a grapple hook you could use anywhere would be really fun in context of the game, but you can only use it when the game wants you to. So it's like you may as well just have a fucking spring. Yep. Because it, it's so worthless, and it's it's the more I think about this game, Stephen, the angrier I get. Fuck By the way, Stephen, guess where we're going? Where are we going? Green Hill again? Chemical Plant. Oh my fuck. <laughs> it's the network terminal. <laughs> yeah, to, look. We're gonna go find the computer room. Termin yeah. Terminal velocity? Find the network terminal. I'm good at What do you mean you have guys? to capture the chemical? <laughs> like, you gotta catch it in your arms and see... hold it close? No, he's gonna throw a Pokeball at it. Oh. <laughs> it's also weird how this is like, this is the first. No, it's not. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this, this is the first Sonic game in forever where all the supporting characters actually play a role in it and they barely do anything. Well, they tell it's you like, lots of cool things that are happening. But nothing important. Well, I mean, if you could see yeah, it, I'm just sure like it you, Stefan. Um, 80% of their forces get wiped out soon. That's very important. Oh, shit. That does happen, doesn't <laughs> it? Wait, that was Operation Big Wave. That already happened. Oh, we, we completely we missed, missed the fact that 80% <laughs> of their forces died instantly. Instantly. A throwaway line in the stage. Oh, like, the so entire resistance. The entire resistance just died. David, what David, what was that fucking trip? When did we did we do gift bump when it was right before Memorial Day? Yeah. And so you kept on making a bunch of operation Oh my god, I hate it. And Aubrey. and remember remember this and that was a plan by Knuckles that he came up with in about a minute. Knuckles <laughs> is responsible <laughs> for the death of thousands. <laughs> It is not his conscience. Because he was ever. like, we gotta hit him fast and hit him hard. It's like, oh, they all died. Well, it's not like how my entire... I just want a documentary where he's just like, they knew what they were signing up for. <laughs> That's all he says. This, is, this isn't fun, guys. This is war. What did you expect was gonna happen? Like, look, I know, I know loss. 
you know I lost my entire civilization? I mean, I maybe don't remember that. I don't know if I have parents. It was maybe hundreds oh, of years before I just I was realized born. That, that, that this whole game is The Last Jedi. What? The whole Why? resistance gets wiped out. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, and the casino Stephen. stage is here, and it's completely pointless. <laughs> <laughs> we have Kylo Ren here. They're looking for, they're looking oh for like, the, their savior. Stefan, no. This is the part where the FBI notification comes up. It's like, you know too much. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Chris, Chris's avatar is female, who goes looking for the one person Garrett. who can save them. Sonic yeah. is Luke Skywalker in this game. Yes! Garrett. All right, and Sonic doesn't train anyone. He's just like, hey, guys. <laughs> She's imagining all the training. Sonic, Sonic just starts. Sonic just starts milking cows and drinking <laughs> the juice. So amazing! Who is, uh... Every word you just said is wrong. <laughs> so I like how that one level gave us like twenty percent of the world on a small island, like fucking Australia. <laughs> not even that big. But like we just we we literally overtook Eggman's own fortress. How the fuck does that get us back the world? <laughs> oh man, the Death Egg, Death Egg. So was Eggman actually Ben Swallow? Considering. <laughs> just give me a shot of shirtless Eggman. <laughs> I do want to say though, at the um, the start of the previous, I, I think I said this in the brain scratch RP, but the start of of the previous chemical plant level, I think would have made visually wise, I, I, I not half bad all ocean zone, because all yeah. of the ship looked like oil. It would like TJ would have loved it. That boy loves all to, those types of music. Oh, to give this to give this level some credit, I like that they that they brought back they used uh, the Sonic Three and Knuckles uh, Death Egg because all the time in Death Egg they used the Sonic Two one. So I like to see yeah, so I like yeah, to see I'll this one that. actually being referenced. Right. Yeah, I think I I, I actually I think know Sonic Three and K's I actually think Sonic Three and K's Death Egg is a very underrated level it in the is, franchise with a great music pay. It's the Sonic Three stage we should have gotten in generations and didn't. All right. Except now it's bad. All right, now, Steven, I want I want to point out something, okay? Sonic the Hedgehog is okay. on the Death Egg, right? Now, we were on the okay. Death Egg earlier. Remember that. Okay. Remember that. Okay. Remember all this. Okay. 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 So point some stuff out. Okay. okay. This will be on the test, Steven, so you better start. Yep. All right. Okay. Any, oh, okay. That's all for right now. What were you going to fucking say, no, David? No, just wait. <laughs> I just want you to keep that in mind. Remember? Chekhov's yes, gun. just remember. Yeah. Remember, we were here before. Lur Lurker's gun. Sonic fought Zavik. There were other prisoners. Just keep all that in mind, okay? Keep all that in mind. Oh. I know what he's <laughs> Yeah, yeah, this. yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, but anyway. <laughs> so Vector's like, ah! Okay. Oh, man. He, do he does do that quite a bit in this game. Yeah. Oh, it's a thing. Look at, uh, oh, they made it so... Uh, not as satisfying. Meh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah. The, the, the sound effect is horrible. You just ran one. off. I guess it doesn't matter. I'm saving yeah. time. Oh, <laughs> Sonic! You're the best! Oh. Classic Sonic looks at Tails and nods yeah. and rubs his stomach. I do like, though, that, um, I don't know if we've seen it yet, in the background, though, you can see, uh, like, bits from Sonic 3, like the... What, what is that thing called? Is it the Act 1 boss? Can't, isn't he hiding out here? Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, yeah. That's cool. I like that. It's a little nod, being like... That's a, a, a nice visual, you know, reference. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> now we're invincible. Run on the treadmill. Oh, for a second I thought those bad nicks were pandas. <laughs> Fuck no, I'm not hurting a what panda. Is the, what is the point of that fucking section with the conveyor belt and those, what was this jump to be murdered? Okay, yeah. so, uh, Steven, hey, uh, what's going on? <laughs> oh, no! Oh. <laughs> Yeah, oh, no. we just committed genocide! <laughs> Hooray! There, there's not even a throwaway, throwaway line saying, oh, we got all of them out of there beforehand. Yeah. <laughs> oh this my is god! The of steel. They're all. Jesus Christ! Well, Knuckles is like, oh, I accidentally killed our army. Well, we might as well wipe out the rest. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god! Eggman, Egg, Egg, Eggman can't kill our troops and fight them first! So like I said, they knew what they were signing up for. <laughs> They're all fucking dead! <laughs> Steven's now tro- Steven, does that- The fact that Knuckles just wiped out his own troops does that make you like or hate this game more now? I'm glad he's the last echidna! <laughs> <laughs> The, 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 Star Wars Episode Eight: The Last. Well, the, 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 this cutscene makes no sense because it, it makes you think that Infinite's gonna betray Eggman, but nope. 
Nothing Spoilers! Happens. Also, they're back to that spot in Green Hill hanging out again. Oh, like, again, why, why does destroying the Death Egg help them get the world back? In terms of, of like, percentage-wise. Uh, uh, also, who had the camera view of the Death Egg exploding from outer space? Shut up, Chris. Uh, I think it was Ray the Flying Squirrel. He's been drifting out there for a while. He was, he was, right. Chris, he was, he was, para like he was periscoping it, alright? <laughs> oh, gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all about that. Are we done? Yeah. Are we fucking done? Fucking Let's do it, guys. Whoa. Oh. That was a joke. An omelet. Don't count your chickens. <laughs> Who wrote this dialogue? No, no, there's a lot of... <laughs> and why are they allowed to be paid? There's a lot of good jokes there. Smashing chickens and eggs and, and Amy's sad for some reason. <laughs> Amy's sad for some reason. <laughs> 90% of our forces were wiped out. <laughs> She's not allowed to be sad. And hey, I, 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 90% of our forces were wiped out. I, I murdered all the Unlike, I unlike all the other games, uh, <laughs> weren't, weren't there other writers brought into this, not just Warren Graf? Well, there, there's a I Japanese think I called, writer. I called, yeah, well, according to the credits, it was the Japanese writer who I believe wrote Fro 6, wrote the initial story. And then Pontac and Graf did the translations. Mm, no, it was some Itaro Toyota guy. He's been working at Sonic Team, but... Oh, well, see, what well, is, is that not the 06 writer? No, it's someone else. It was yeah. the, it was oh, okay. the 06, uh, uh, the director is the producer of this game. Yeah, I think that's where a lot of the confusion came from. Because the guy who was in charge of 06 is in charge of this game, but it's not the same writer. And that's where... Oh, okay. Like, there's definitely a, a lot of... There, there's certain things that are like 06 vibes. It's probably not because of how bad the story is yet. And I mean, like the fact that Silver's in there. It's trying to be a darker story. It's trying to be like this this sweeping epic. Because you know, some Sonic stories are smaller. I I mean, I like I know Unleashed is a big wide epic. Even though, well, the plot to Unleashed was conceived Unleashed by the same may, person who wrote 06, but she didn't Unleashed, write. Unleashed might Unleashed. be bigger, but at least it's not fucking dark. No, yeah, there, there's certain, like, no. I, at least, at least, at least has like small dark moments, but the overall, the overall tone of, of yeah, at least it's, it's surprisingly optimistic. Right, well, yeah, dude, so, so this section is like I, I, I fell off boosting on this section so many times. The control is so bad. Uh, the, no boost allowed. The yeah. director of Forces also directed uh, Sonic Colors and Lost World. That's crazy that, that, the, that the director of Colors directed this game. Because I love Colors, and this game I do not. Oh! I don't see a coffin! Sniffs his armpit. <laughs> <laughs> what is q doing? What is q doing there? They're trying so hard to be good characters, but they just are not allowed to be in this game. Why was I programmed to be an idiot? <laughs> Sounds just like yeah. It was animated in Gmod. Oh god, so no space might be the the most pointless addition to this entire game. Well, you're gonna enjoy all that nothing. It is such a, it is such a pointless idea. Oh no, concept. we have been banished to this place. But if we run fast enough, we will be fine. I it's a literal plot hole. I They're geniuses. I found the oh. I found the writer of Forces. Uh, they haven't written. Uh, they didn't write any of the other games. This is the first time. Yeah, well, they were like because, again. The first, programmer, uh, the right? writer of Unleashed was a first-time scenario writer. That came out they were came out. Uh, they were a character supervisor and level designer for most of the other games, like Heroes, Shadow, uh, designed bosses for Unleashed. Uh, that explains so a lot. That's, so that's why the designs for this game are so shit because that designer was writing the script instead. This is so. This is such a dumb thing. Welcome to the I'm, Disco Palace. And also, it's like, so, like, they don't no, need a power-up in context of the game. They don't, they don't need a power-up to double boost. Why can't they just double boost everything? Can I, can I ask something about double boost? Yeah, yeah. Sure. Yes. You don't tape two cars together and then they instantly go faster. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, Steven, we should, we should try it. Let's oh, Gareth, break. okay, Gareth, if you and I hold hands, we can run <laughs> twice as fast. Because that's how it fucking works, isn't it? We should totally do a skip on that. Also, the OC can't boost. So what? Whoa. Yeah. Also, well, so, 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 like again, kind, kind of like the uh, Metal Sonic Bridge section. No space has a whole like two-minute track that you spend 15 seconds in. Like the amount of wasted time, like people would have had to have done behind the scenes 
Like, what a... F- it's I, just... It's I so think dumb. someone found some unused voice lines that would have happened in No Space 2, so I guess at some point they were planning it to be, like, a longer narrative thing, maybe? And then they just... But even then, just... A, a Sonic game Sonic with cut movie. content because it was rushed? No. Okay. I will... You know... I... I will say though, on, on a kind of stylistic choice, the, the uh, idea to use fist bump here on a thematic level kind of works. I mean, fist bump's not a great song, but they take the best it, parts of it for this. It, it works, yeah. I mean, this this section here is essentially just after the after the solo. It's this, and they just repeat that section over and over again. Which again, it works in in concept. This, you know, it would have been better if this was a better song, but you know, you have to work with what you got. Okay, I think I figured out the double boost. So the game designers no, you did assumed not. at this point <laughs> no, that you, you would be not. wearing the gamer hat and that you would be able to get out of it at that point. <laughs> so really, you, you dropped the ball, Chris. You're next to oh. me and I'm next to you. Oh, they did the, the Spagonia thing. They went up the top and then zoomed down. <laughs> Standing united after the fight is won. Alright, this song's a spoiler. Ooh. Yeah. Maybe I didn't want to know that Sonic won at the end. Oh. Oh, we found him again. <laughs> They're just, just waiting there. <laughs> uh, hi. He's just waiting. See, what, what are they, what are they saying? Attack him, attack that, that him. That feels very SA one ish to me, so I kind of like that. <laughs> <laughs> the end. Okay, we're almost there. We're almost there, boys. Jesus Steven, Christ. Only 12 Jesus more parts. Christ. <laughs> God. <laughs>